Yo, shalom. All praises to the Most High. Yo ho, yo ho, shua. This is sounds from YYBY. So, you see what the videos say. You go into options, preference, and you like, man, what the hell going on? I don't see the bit rate. You know, I don't see 32-bit float. I don't see none of them. Like, what type of doll don't have that? And we so used to every doll having that and giving you that option. We so caught up in quality. You know, we want everything to sound right. And um, and then sometimes when some people fit realize that it don't have that option, they're like, man, I can't use this doll. Because, you know, 24 and 32 bit flow and 64 bit, all those situations matter. When it comes to technical things of dealing with music, we all know that. It's levels to it. It's pros and cons. Just like the same thing with a sample rate. So, I'm about to help y'all and give y'all the juice if you don't know. And what it is is that reason has it. Matter of fact, y'all gotta keep y'all gotta keep keep in mind that. Reason's the only doll that's built in the concept of analog. So, for everybody don't understand my point is that if you ever use analog, it's a different perspective. It's a different approach. Uh, it sound different when it comes to peaks. You can raise the volume higher. Like on the mixer, and you won't receive peaks. You know, you get you get red, but it won't distort. That's what I'm saying. In digital, you you have that problem. You can't. So that's why people be so scared when they dealing with the the digital output in dolls, especially in reasons, right? So reasons is built. As the digital with the analog sound and concept. That's dope. So now, let's get to the point which you came to the video for. The reason why you don't see that option inside Reasons, the 24-bit stuff, is because Reasons is built in using 32-bit float. Yes, it's already built in. They say, you know what? We're going to give it to you anyway. Why use 16-bit? Why use 24-bit? You do that when you export out. You know, that's why when you notice when you export out, you go to... Let me go to see the bounce. You got 16-bit, 24-bit, right? But you got Ditta already checked. So that means that if you're already mastering your song in 24-bit or whatever higher rate bit you have, and when you got to bring it down to 16-bit for the basic audio sound, which is 44, 16 bit, which they say, like, well, I know back in the digit, the tape days, CDs and stuff like that, even files now is 44, 16 bit. Some websites is give you the option to load up a higher bit that, you know, um, so even with the MP3 format and reasons, you go to MP3, you say, damn, well, I don't see no options for exporting out the MP3. When you go right here, and I said this in the other video, when you go to export song and you, you click MP3, you don't have no options of quality. Reason why? Because big, I mean, reasons automatically set it to 320. Why not? What's wrong with that? That's what most would click anyway, right? So, yeah, so. So reasons is built in with 32 bit float, which is 1540 dB dynamic range. This is why when it go in the red, it really don't hurt. Or it's no distortion. We you know whatever it is, right? So it's putting all signals together uh through the outputs. Master. Now check this out. So once you do all your music, you create in, so on and so forth. Making your beats. You get it to your mix. You mix it down. You're sending everything through the, the master output. 
it automatically changes to 64-bit float. So it's really no loudness and reasons, man. And I remember back in the day when I was using it. And I, I never understood. I like, what the hell is going on? Like, you know, you know, it, 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 a lot of people was kind of complaining about their approach. But the reason why most didn't understand is because they probably never used analog. They started doing music in the digital life. See, it's a difference. See, a lot of people who only use digital, that's all they know. They have a different perspective when people who already experienced the analog and then when they change from analog to digital. And it's good to listen to them. You get, you get a different understanding of music. So most dogs give you that option. I don't need the option if it's already providing it for me, to be honest with you. It's like it's like reasons have certain options where it's like we know what you need. We know what you got to have. Boom. The only flaw is that I don't think they throw it out there in big words and say, hey, this is what we have. It's kind of like you got to go search for it. <laughs> so, yeah. So that's the point, yo. So now y'all know this is why, why, be why. Any questions? Peace. Ask me.